What's up everybody my name is Zen and welcome back to another video of Cyber Attack. Um, you guys have been very highly requesting this. Uh, thank you guys so much for liking the last video that was greatly appreciated and we have actually hit 200 subs um, and it's been a few <laughs> been a few days. Um, I am recording this uh, as it is the end of Christmas um, because I was just having fun with my parents and all that stuff and then they end up with going away and uh, now I'm just here with the kids and all that and I'm probably going to get some mates to do some <sighs> probably watch a game I'm not too sure because we have been all over the place for the past few days and it's just been uneasy but not the topic what we're going to be looking at is when we were down by zero and three and we pulled back and everybody every single one of those teams rage quit because i clutched a 1v a 1v6 and it was just a crazy game so i really hope you guys enjoyed the video if you guys do make sure to leave a like hit that subscribe button if you are new to the channel um we are hitting a new setting goal for this particular week um and unfortunately it's actually close to new year so i'm not gonna actually put the pulse on y'all but we're probably gonna push to 210 by this week so um i really hope um we get through that but if we can't then that's fine um i'm happy with the audience that i have i just wanted to actually make another term goal because why not motivate myself even more by um expanding it so um without a doubt this is probably one of the best games i've ever had now um here's how it goes my teammates completely die um and i was left alone now one of the few was um resing everybody so things were uneasy so i couldn't really um get through this alone and some of my friends were in the call and i couldn't hear so i had to stay focused and talk to myself because normally I do that to myself because literally I would either critique myself or anything like that because that's normally me or I'll just end up like um, saying things just to calm myself down because I'm not in a better mindset to like put everything in my head I'm just saying it out loud is kind of don't get me wrong it's weird I get it but that's just me but yeah we basically just uh, clutch this entire thing uh, this dude had no idea. Either he didn't shoot me at all, or he just chose not to. So, I pretty much clutched that immediately, and then we got that round. And then we started pulling me back after that. So, it was weird, because um, during this entire round, uh, like, as we were going to the tie, I started dominating a little bit, so did my teammates. So, this was where we were actually doing a bit better. But, the few things that were lacking is the fact that their IQ was so abruptly low that you could clearly tell in the gameplay they were not like thinking straight because there were about a couple times where my teammates and I don't know why there were a couple times where my teammates decided not to rush one person that I weakened and it was just weird to me I was trying to figure out why they wouldn't do it and then of course it hit me that the fact that these guys are very slow <laughs> So I have to literally step up as a result to do everything. <laughs> and it's such a pain. <laughs> it is such a pain. So as a result, we had to go back and fix a lot of things, let me tell you. Um, so it went back to me trying to fix everything. And then I have to go back and redominate uh, everything. Because guarantee you, they all literally ran with <laughs> this dude right here specifically ran a Finnick and I think some of them were running MP5s and Kilos probably one of the red gun, regular guns in the game uh, and probably one of the most toughest guns in the game I was using AQ AN94 AN excuse me but even so it takes a long time for me to get better with those guns so this was kind of in the middle of me practicing with it because sometimes, and to be quite honest, I haven't played the game for at least a couple months. 
a couple months for it. Because, like I said before, I haven't played the game since 2019. So, things were getting uneven for me, so... <laughs> Um, practicing makes perfect, and I knew exactly what to do after that. Um, so I set a few streaks in, in there, and of course, uh, we had good UAVs. We had a lot of uh, decent stuff to get them cleared out. Now, as you probably noticed from the leaderboard, you noticed that these guys have officially left. From the lower boards all the way down to the dudes that we had last time. We were dominating them, don't get me wrong. It's just that there was a lot of times where my teammates just wouldn't think straight like as soon as I rush somebody they immediately just stand there like a fucking potato I couldn't even like think about like what they were trying to do in that scenario and I was so confused so as the results kick in I'm trying to figure out what the hell they're doing it just doesn't seem to add up to me it really doesn't so as I'm ready to like get everything set you notice how half my team dies over the most simplest of shit. It just goes back to what I was saying before. You wonder why I stopped playing Cyber Attack. And why I stopped doing it competitively. Because the shit is annoying with skill based matchmaking. And you wonder why I didn't play, like, Cold War. <laughs> it's because of that specific reason. I cannot, and I repeat, I cannot keep playing a game that has skill based matchmaking which makes it boring <laughs> it is so boring for me to play it because number one I'm not in the competitive seat I, I stopped playing competitive years ago and the reason I just wanted to do, do uh, cyber attack was just to play differently but then you start to notice how every time I try to have fun with it it just immediately becomes oh yeah I have to dominate every time and it's like yo this shit gets old. So, every time I use like regular guns every time, like I just got bored of it and all that, so I just decided to keep changing it. I've changed up like every time when I use it, but whenever I um, I was just bored and I just wanted to play, I just decided to use the regular guns as a way to just have a little bit of fun. Like the 725, the M4, uh, maybe the P90 just to have some scandals. But as far as anything, I just didn't, like, care. I just didn't care. So, it wasn't something I was truly caring myself about at all. So, mainly, I'm just keeping it hunted. There was just no reason for me to even, like, do that. And boy, I do regret it because literally every single person is running a red gun in this game. And, and when I be... Well, I'm pretty sure you guys already know what I mean by that. But, anyway... Going back to what I was saying, you have to realize that as I play this game, I realize it's gotten even more competitive than it should have been. And that's saying something. That's literally saying something in this game. And not to lie to y'all about these whole scenarios, but at the same time, you also have typical, typical, just saying, typical teammates that literally don't push with you. Like, you see what I mean? Like, I just never get this type of common sense with them. Like, do you guys don't push at all? Like, it's like their mindset is completely off. Like, first of all, you have two different players that refused to push up. Like, you, if you go back on the video right now, literally two of them, two of them were on the map. And they did not move, not a single time. The only time they moved was when I literally died. Seriously? Okay. Let me say something to, for the people that don't understand. Team balancing is supposed to be based on somebody's, somebody's IQ and most importantly their way of, way of understanding teammates. If they can't fucking do that, they refuse and they refuse that, there's a slight chance they can't fucking do anything about it. So, going back to what I was saying before, you have three different players who are this fucking bottom level, and you put them on my team just for me to carry them? Again, it goes back to what I was saying before. Skill-based matchmaking was broken, but I should have known that when I first came back, because... That was my dumbass fault for not realizing that. And I thought, 
thought that, hey, any regular functioning human being wouldn't have any idea how to fucking do that. But no, I was completely wrong. <laughs> I was completely wrong. So, going back to what I was saying, we finished the game with a tie, mainly because of the fact that I got, got dead. Because, let's be serious here, my teammates are shit. They can't do a damn thing. And this is what I was talking about. Where there is a certain OP gun, and that is a prime example of it. The Finnick liter literally sprayed me down within three bullets. <laughs> and the MP5, with close range, keep in mind, missed every single one. <laughs> I get it if it doesn't have hip fire, like the late laser for it, but at the same time, are you kidding me? Like, come on, man, you're just wasting my time if you're gonna tell me that the submachine gun does not require close quarters. That just doesn't seem to add up, especially when you're ADSing. But, we won the game, and they rage quit, and uh, that sums it up, man. This game, man, this game has officially just made it not fun anymore to play God. I'm just saying.